Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight, we will be addressing a couple phrases and terms that really get yeah. our go. This show's gonna suck. Alright, so first term of the day. Turn um, up! <laughs> what exactly I'm does this mean? Your friend. <laughs> My friend, he was just like, say you invite your friend to a party that's gonna be going on tonight, then you'd be like, oh, turn up. And I was like, what? And he was like, yeah, you just turn up. I should read you guys the message I got from my friend, though. I'll be right back. But then... <laughs> <laughs> but then, I was talking to my friend today, who also happens to be black. And... Maybe it's just like, we don't get it, because we're Cause white. Because neither of us are black. Uh, I um, think I'm black. You just said we're white. I'm definitely not white. Anyway, so... He was like, hey, are you going home for fall break? And I was like, no, but I'm in Colorado with a buddy. And he's like, hey, turn up, ha ha. And I was like, what are you talking about? Turn up to where? It's like, I'm pretty sure you can turn up in Colorado. There's like moose and deer everywhere. Turn up. See, this and is where I get confused. Mental image is a turnip. It makes no sense. Okay, next term. Um, tan bark. Okay, this is a problem. Only people in the Bay Area or California know what tan bark is. Everyone else calls it wood chips. Or mulch. I don't know. I remember vividly in kindergarten calling it tan bark. And so this is just always stuck with me. And then tonight, like, I just found out that, like, the rest of the world doesn't call it tan bark. And so I'm very confused and very lost in life, but I think I'll manage what tan dumb bark. word. <laughs> You're a dumb word. <laughs> Shut no, up. It's called tan bark. <laughs> Definitely is. No. Next term. Swag. Apparently there's like a couple thoughts on what swag actually means. Some people say it's something whites ain't got. Other people say it's something we Asians got. And then it it's really... It's something we all got, if anything. Or yeah. But swag. really, the dictionary definition is how like the drapes in a curtain, how they hang. Is it's it really? Swag. Ornamental festoon of flowers. Shut up. No, it's not. Curtain. It has to do with curtains. See, arrange or in or decorate with a swag or swags of fabric. Let me show y'all right here. I'm kind of confused because I don't know if I should take that as a compliment or be like, I'm a bouquet of flowers. It makes no sense. Stop using the word. It's stupid. Murica. Come on, Texas. Why? Get it together. I actually really hate that word. I, I hate God it so much. God bless America. Hold up, girl. I actually hate that word so much. I feel the need to put that in the about me section of um, my social network profile. She obviously has a problem. We're putting her through counseling. I'm driving me nuts. I'll pray for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Lastly. Last one. I really don't like when people pronounce words like ass wrong. <laughs> what? Like, ax? I asked him. <laughs> like, you asked him? Like a tree? Or, like, warsh? Where'd the warsh. R come from? Like, like, umble? <laughs> Sorry, Billy Wilson. <laughs> Where did the ancient humble go? <laughs> Who says umble? Umble. Why? I ate a and piece then, of umble And fat. then, those same people, when they say other words, they overemphasize the H. The H. Quitch? Like, Who says quitch? Quitch. Why? No. Why would you take the H out of... Humble and just ow, ow, uh. annoying is. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed the show and thank you for tuning in. I'm so sorry for wasting <laughs> these like three minutes of your life. We'll be here every week if you wanna, you know, turn up. <laughs>